It is fortunate that you found me. Quickly, this way. Perfect! He won't trouble us anymore! See those soldiers down there. We are not as well supplied as the enemy, so we'll have to improvise. Aim at the fuel barrels rather than the soldiers. Good! You are ready for battle again. We're not out of the woods yet. It's us or them. He's wounded! You have a help! Relax. Saves this man's life! Yo, that was close. I guess I owe you. Watch our status! Okay, come with me, guys. I've got supplies that'll get us out of this mess. Grab a Molotov! Let's show the Reds! Babies! Oh yeah, baby! Steve Reich and he's out! No time to waste. They'll be back if we don't hurry. Open this manhole with your wrench. We can escape to safety below in the suit. Citizens of New York and comrades from the Soviet Armed Forces, welcome to our first news broadcast after today's events. My name is Tatiana Kempinski, and I will be your regular news anchor from now on. We hope in time to obtain the cooperation of most of your familiar TV personalities once they return from a re-education program at our training facilities in Alaska. Meanwhile, I will make sure you get all necessary information about our efforts to restore peace and stability in your troubled country. Our Soviet leaders have been concerned for years by the plight of the poor American people suffering under a corrupt regime. Today we have finally succeeded in liberating the suppressed masses of Americans from further hardship, and we will soon restore law and order in a new rule of government. And we expect and believe that every citizen will swear allegiance to this new order. Cooperate and you will reap all the benefits of the Soviet system. All measure of resistance will be futile and dealt with swiftly. Our great leader, Comrade General Tatarin, will be addressing the nation later. So on behalf of the dedicated staff here at the studio and the glorious Soviet armed forces, welcome New York to a better future.
This is our base. It's a safe zone. We store equipment here. With complete control of the sewer system, the tunnels enable us to bypass many of the Soviet roadblocks. All of our maps will indicate the location of the sewer access points. Let us go over to the table and take a look. The post office is a Soviet stronghold. It is used as a supply depot to support troops advancing into the city. Your brother is being held somewhere inside. Raise your flag on the roof to signal our victory. To get near the police station, you'll have to destroy a sniper's nest on the gas station. Yo, man. I gotta talk to you. Wanna blow that gas station? You're gonna need some explosives. You can find some in the other neighborhood. No way, pal. No one gets by until Isabella is free. The post office is a Soviet stronghold. It is used as a supply depot to support troops advancing into the city. Your brother is being held somewhere inside. Raise your flag on the roof to signal our victory. To get near the police station, you'll have to destroy a sniper's nest on the gas station.